Hi guys, this week we are getting into part one of a series called Toxic Chemicals in Your Home. This is part one. Today we're talking about household cleaners. What's up guys, my name is Savannah. I teach modern hippies how to live a more natural and healthy lifestyle through mindfulness and science. Today we're creating a safe, non-toxic, natural, and super effective household cleaner from just a few simple ingredients. It is antibacterial and a great substitute to Lysol or Clorox wipes, and in fact, may even be better than Lysol and Clorox wipes. I'll link a little study about that down below. It's also safer for food preparation areas and young children. So if you're interested in this quick little fun DIY to create a more natural yet better household cleaner, then definitely keep on watching. Before we dive in, won't you be an absolute babe and hit that subscribe button. I put out new videos every single week. So here is what you're going to need. A spray bottle, I recommend a glass one, just lasts longer, no BPA from plastic degradation. A small container, I'm gonna be using this test tube today. Your favorite essential oils. <laughs> and purified H2O. So the essential oils that I'm gonna be using today are eucalyptus, rosemary, frankincense, peppermint, jasmine, and a lemon orange combo. Really quick, comment down your favorite essential oil and why. There are so many freaking uses to essential oils and they're just naturally antimicrobial. I love them so much. I use them in Blissful's natural deodorant. I use them for all kinds of all natural remedies and salves that I create. They are a godsend. I'm gonna link below my favorite brand. Go check that out. And um, according to this list, the best antibacterial oils are peppermint, tea tree, lavender, eucalyptus, oregano, palma rosa, orange, lemongrass, geranium, and citronella. So if you don't have any yet, or you have any of those, those are the ones that are gonna be the most antibacterial, so pick those, or at least one of them. And I'm gonna link my YouTube video right here about essential oils FAQ. If you don't know anything about them, go have a look. So step one is to open up your bottle, get it ready, because we're gonna pour some stuff in it. Step two is going to be to add your essential oils blend to your smaller secondary container. It doesn't really matter what combination you add them in. If you have one that's especially antibacterial that was on that list I just mentioned, then I would probably put that one in the most uh, quantity wise, but just have fun with it and get it to where you just love the smell because you're gonna be spraying it all over your house. So once you've added them all, give it a nice little swirl, whatever container it is in. You're going to add that to your bottle and see how this bottle is amber colored? That's really great because the amber coloring protects um, sunlight from coming in and degrading whatever you have in the bottle. And then next is just to add your water. Maybe you want to do this over a sink because you're not that great at pouring. I, uh, however, am really good at pouring. I've done a lot of pouring and I spilled it everywhere. So fill it up all the way, put your spray top back in, and you're good to go. You can spray this bad baby anywhere. Like, And because it's just water and essential oil, you don't need to fear any chemical reactions. Mm, that actually smells really good. <laughs> and my hand's clean now. So use this to clean any surface where you normally use bleach, Lysol, or Clorox. It's just as effective, if not more effective. Again, really great if you have small children or you're cleaning an area where food is prepped because Lysol wipes and then like food around that same, uh, uh, eating Lysol can, mm, no, we don't wanna do that. Stick to this stuff, it's amazing, it smells great and it's it does the job next week we're talking about anti-aging we're going in depth on practices to keep you beautiful and healthy as long as possible we'll discuss antioxidants collagen supplements sun exposure skin care and more don't want to miss it so be sure to subscribe and if you want to learn more about how to live a more healthy natural holistic lifestyle start by watching one of these two videos right here thank you so much for watching have a blissful day